Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Silvana here and Luna, as you guys can see. <laughs> She's just chilling. Hi, baby. Today I thought we would create another full look. So I already have my brows done, face moisturized and primed. So are the eyes and the lips. So we're just gonna get started on the eyes. Before we start into today's makeup look, just want to give you a sneak peek in next week's makeup look. This is going to be the look that I'll be creating next week. So if you guys want to see how I created and what products I use and everything, then come back next week and we'll do it together. If you like today's look, please subscribe to my channel, like and share with your friends. Hit that notification bell so you can be notified every week when I post a video. And without further ado, let's jump into the look. The palette I'm using today is the Icon Pro by Absolute New York, the Master Shadow Collection. And I'll take this color to be my first transition shade. So for the past couple of months, we were working on renovating our kitchen. The house was, let's just say, a mess. Because when you're doing renovations, it literally turns your house upside down. My second transition shade will be this one right here. Installing the cabinets took about a month to get the installers out here. because they were completely booked for the summer so to darken the outer corner I'll be using this beautiful brown color right here after they installed the cabinets we had to wait for my father-in-law and my husband's schedule to clear up because they did all the electric and all the plumbing they took care of it To cut my crease, I'm using the IT Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye Full Coverage Anti-Aging Waterproof Concealer in the shade Medium Natural. To set a time that both my husband and my father-in-law are free is like a miracle to get that time set. And for the lid, I am taking this beautiful color right here. And as usual, every time you do renovation, something has to pop up in the renovation. It can never go smoothly. So every time they would, like, we set a date and they would come and we would be working, something would pop that it needs to be, that we need to reschedule for another day. To line my eyes, I'm using the Aurora Intensively Precise Eyeliner in the shade Espresso. We finally managed to finish off the entire kitchen just this past Saturday. To line my upper waterline, I'm using the Mino Generation uh, Perfect Eye Lip Liner in the shade number 15. Beautiful brown color here. All last week was cleanup time after the mess of the kitchen. I'm gonna go ahead and apply my mascara as usual using the primer, first layer of mascara and a second layer of mascara. For lashes I'm using the A Joy False Lash Box. And I am taking this style right here. For glue, I'm using the Real False Lashes Invisible Lash Glue by Benefit. I'm gonna apply my lashes really quickly off camera. If you guys want to see how I apply my lashes, check out this video right up here. I explain how I apply my lashes in it, okay? To line my lower waterline, I'm using the Me Now Generation Perfect Eye Lip Liner and the shade number 14 it's beautiful light green color right here so for cleaning I started by cleaning out all the debris all the excess 
materials that they never used. Finish working on the top of my eyes. I'm gonna go ahead and finish off the face off camera and I'll be right back to finish off the under eyes and the lips. If you guys want to see a detailed video of how I do my face, check out this video right up here. And I'll leave the link also at the end of the video. Face is done. Let's finish off the under eyes really quickly. For my transition shade for the under eye, I'm taking this color right here. After I finished cleaning the debris and everything, I had to finish off cleaning the paint stains that were left behind. Switching to the Butter London Natural Goddess palette, I'm taking this beautiful star color right here. After I finished cleaning all the paint stains, I started putting back all the electronics in the kitchen. To highlight my inner corner and my brow bone, I'm using this beautiful color right here. And the last thing I did was wipe down all the countertops and mop the floors. Gonna go ahead and apply my mascara with the same product and the same order for my lower lash line. For my lower lashes, I mean. Sorry. Eyes and face are done. Only thing left is the lips. And today I'm using the Milani lipstick in the shade 27, Dulce Carmella. And these are the pictures of the kitchen after it was done. To set my face, I'm using the Beauty Crop Cocoa Gold Mist. This is the finished look you guys, I hope you enjoyed this, and like I said, if you want to see how I create next week's makeup look, don't forget to come back. If you like this look, subscribe to my channel, like and share with your friends, hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a video. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye!